Hey folks, it's Kurt from Whitetails Deer Hunting. I've got an old ladder stand that a buddy of mine gave me. It's been on his property for about 20 years. It's one of the smaller, older, lightweight stands, and it's going to be perfect to take out on public land with me. Problem is, it's all gray. So today I'm going to sit down and I'm going to take a whole bunch of different colored paints and I'm going to sponge paint this to make it look more camouflaged when I take it out into the woods and use it this upcoming fall. You can see that the base coat on this metal ladder stand is gray. So I'm gonna start with one of my darker colors, maybe a dark brown. I'm gonna cut a piece of sponge and I'm gonna grab a piece of cardboard and I'll spray paint onto the piece of cardboard. I'll dab the sponge on the cardboard and I'll work my way up and around this entire first side of this uh, gray metal ladder stand with the dark color. I'll let that dry, I'll flip it over, I'll do the same color on the back and then I'll continue to alternate light and dark colors as I work through trying to get this thing camouflaged so it blends much better into the woods than what it would right now as a solid gray color. This is when I really start to see a difference when I do the tan. I don't do a lot of tan, but just enough to help break up some of those areas of dark colors. I almost got this ladder camouflage painted the other day, but I've got caught up with work for a couple days here and we've had some pretty heavy afternoon thunderstorms with high humidity. So I showed you a little bit the other day how I had water on this and I spray painted around it and you can see how it left a water droplet pattern on there. I was just experimenting with it so I'm going to play around with it here again today. Um, I'm going to spray a little bit of water on here and I'm going to see how it comes out by putting some more paint on it and trying to give it more of that bubbled appearance as camouflage. Give this maybe five minutes to go ahead and dry. Have some of the evaporation start, leaving some water droplets here and there. And then I'm gonna go ahead and uh, hit it with some darker paint, uh, maybe even a couple of light colors on dark areas and see if I can create more of that bubbled appearance. Here's the finished project. I've got all three pieces of the ladder and the support bar all camouflaged, mostly with sponge. Did a little bit with some water and uh, came out all right. I mean, you see some bubbles like right there. Didn't come out great, but something a little bit different. Just um, give the opportunity to have a little bit of a camouflage appearance that we're taking a look at. So here it is. It is done. Let it sit here for about a month, month and a half outside. Uh, before I go put it up on some public land that I'm going to hunt this year. Okay, I got this tree stand that I came up last set up, ready to go.